Okay, so here is my box of things that I need to do with. Like, maybe I need an evolution stone. Or I need to trade. Here's a pink one. Here's a shiny one that needs an evolution. Here's another shiny one that needs an evolution stone. Woobat, Murkrow, and Weepin' Bell. Wiki Woobat. Friendship. Oh, Woobat needs friendship. Wiki Weepin' Bell. Leafstone. And Murkrow. And dust stone. So we need a leaf stone and a dust stone. And there is still no more sandy gas. Home zero. We've been to Bell, the early riser. And a shiny murkrow. This one's a pink, pink one. Huh? I just. We've been with Alice evolving for some reason. I have no idea why. Sure, why not? Victory Bell! Now I have a pink Victory Bell. A leaf Tornado. That's an interesting one. Okay, it sounds like it's from the anime. The Victory Bell's voice is from the anime. Nice. And then we got this nice uh, shiny Murkrow, which for some reason is evolving. Really just can't figure out why. Love that Cosmog on my head. Really great. Oh, great stuff. Now we have a Hunch Crow. Nice. Now I can put them in the Shinies folder. Because they are fully evolved and done. Shinies. There it is. Shinies. Oh, but they're pink. This one's pink. Oh, I grabbed the wrong one. Right now, my pink folder is mixed with... Oh, here we go. Is mixed with other altar forms, uh, guys. But I got a pink Oddish, a pink Primeape, a pink Paris, Parasect, Bellsprout, Weepin' Bell, Victory Bell, Weedle, Kakuna, Beedrill, Doduo, Dodrio, Pidgeot... Caterpie, Metapod, and Butterfree of the pink set. I also have some Monsoon palette. Don't know what that is. A few strikes. Some Altar of oh, the Crystal guy. We got him on stream. And this isn't all of them because a lot of them are in this, like this Ralt Strike pattern right here. I, I really need to clean my, 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 my mess. It's a mess. It's a mess is what it is. Hunch Crow. This one's a plain shiny and can go into the shiny chest. Nice. Nice. So it is day. Let's go back to a savanna. Nidoran. Wait, do I have this Nidoran? This is the male one. I don't think I have the male one. I do not. Let's put him to sleep. Sleep. Let's use the dream ball. <sighs> nice. And a bunch of Q fonts have spawned, but no Blitzels, Litleos, Doduo, another Nidoran. This weird cricket guy. I caught one of them before. I don't know what it is, but I am interested.
my favorite addition has got to be the Olive Pokemon. Smoliv, I believe its name is. Hilarious. Love it. I think it evolves into a tree for some reason. Do not know why. It evolves into Dolive, and then something else. Come on, I just need two more zebras. Just two more zebras. While we wait for that, have I done the daily rewards today? I have not. What do we get? Pixelmon Upgrade. I think this is the Porygon Evolution item, if I remember right. I still am not a fan of Porygon Z. I would have preferred a wireframe model of Porygon baby version. That's what I wanted. A baby, like all the other babies. At the time, the babies were new. But, uh, I wanted it to be a, 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 a 3D model wire frame. Baby, that would have been so good. Too bad it flew away. I do believe I have the girl, uh, Nidoran. That flittle over there evolves into some horrifying emu. Like, like, ah, zebra! Like, it's some, um... It's like wearing a dress or something. I don't know. But I see the zebras. Let's not use Cloud Sire. There we go. Two more quest girls completed. Whew. Like, these quests were fish these Pokemon and then defeat these Pokemon. And let me tell you, the fishing part was horrible. Some Pokemon just would not be caught. But, let's go ahead and open up our keys! Today we have a shiny key! I don't know why I have this shiny key. One of the mods was having an event, and... Which is like, because there's so many people on the server right now, come to spawn and one of you gets a shiny key. And I got it! <laughs> I didn't think I'd get it. But we've got uh, 17 vote keys, 10 quest keys, a skill key. Which skill was that? Fishing. Fishing. That was from fishing. And uh, the shiny key. Oh, no. Warp crates. Let's, of course, start with the vote keys. Inventory is full. Wonderful. Ten Pokeballs! Properly named. I still don't know where I got those weirdly named Pokeballs from. A new Dust Stone! I just used my Dust Stone! I mean, I still had a few more, but still. Ultra Balls! I'm going to take these apart. 500 Claim Blocks. More Ultra Balls. Two Rare Candy. A Quest Key! More rare candy, tokens, money, 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 tokens, power weight, rare candy, and money. Where's the power weight? Ah, uh, it's this thing. <laughs> For some reason, the ultra balls didn't stack, but the rare candies did. Not sure how that worked, but okay. Quest keys! Money! Tokens! 
More Vokies! Let's go use them! Power Anklet! Galadite! Oh, we do have a Galade! More Pokeballs, more money, and more tokens. One of these days I'm going to use those tokens. Money! Money! Zygarde Cell! I think we just need, like, one more before we can make a 5% Zygarde. Money, money, a new... Oh, wait, I never got a skill pickaxe, actually. Oh, but it has Fortune 5. I'm inclined not to use it as a pickaxe. I'll consider it. And player points. I think you can buy things with the player points here. And I have 420 player points. Ooh, you can buy these. You can buy these. Uh -huh. Oh, also, um, I looked into it. And the silver bottle caps, which hyper trains a single IV of a Pokemon. First of all, you can select which IV it's hyper trains. But... It... It doesn't actually train the IV. Oh, sweet. Look at this. I didn't know about that one. It doesn't actually train the IV. It just makes it... It gives you the stats as though the IV was hyper-trained. As though. So, I'm a little iffy on that now. But, let's go ahead and check out the skill keys. Another clear bell. Great. How many ho-ohs do I need? Okay, here's the shiny now. We get to enjoy the animation, but uh, let's see. Let's see if we get another ho. -Oh. Look at this animation here. Love it. He puts on glasses, and he gave me an Umbreon. Mmm, Globabus. Warp, enchant. Oh, actually, I think we can summon a Zygarde now. Set the clear bell in there. Um, the rare candies as well. Zygarde Pixelmon. Was it 5% or 10% that was needed for the initial creation? Oh, I was wrong. It's 10%. Got to have 10 of these first. Also, I got some more seagrass. Home, point of interest, nine. I, let's put it in um, Route 21. Sure. Route 21 is almost completed. I think I'll finish Route 21, but I have added these trees. To the border, to the border of the new pallet town. I'm not sure about them. Maybe I need a second row in the back. I'm also not sure about which doors to use. I'm definitely sure I'm not using this floor. This floor is not being used. That is not good floor. But which door? If I recall, in the Game Boy Color version of New pa of Pallet Town. Pallet Town was brown, so I might use these ultra the ultra ginkgo doors. I wanted to use red because I have a lot of crimson wood from the quest because there's a quest to c chop that. I didn't want to use the berry doors because they cost apricorns. And I only have so many apricorn logs, but I'm trying. I'm I, I'm going to chop all these down and have some more apricorn logs. I think it's 
three logs per tree. Three logs per tree, and they take forever to grow. Also, here's something fun. It's I, I found this out the other day, and it is hilarious. I don't know why this is in the game, but I have been crafting hyper potions. Crafting hyper potions? I can sell them, sure. Let's set this in here. But see, I got my um, I got my orange berries, I got my citrus berries, I got my figgy berries, and you just craft them. Like this. Why? Oops. Only got one from that one. I was wondering where the number was off. So while I was waiting for those apricorn berry uh, trees to uh, ha to uh, grow, so I could chop them down for the logs, I was just doing this. And I made so many hyper potions for some reason. I mean, I guess they're good to sell. Sure. How much money do I make from this? One hundred and ninety two hyper potions. One hundred and fifteen thousand. That's pretty hilarious. I should probably start doing that. Sasuke is selling this Cosmog for 900,000. Sasuke is selling this Cosmog for 900,000. Should I buy it? Should I buy it? Do I need two Cosmogs? He was selling it for 999,000 previously. My reaction to the 2024... Sadness. I, I usually work at the election polls, and it is just sad. Yeah, I, I've I've mentioned on stream before. I. Uh, I uh, I run an election uh, office, uh, like one of those those places you go to to vote. I I <laughs> I'm in charge of it. It's real awful, and oh, just just these recent years, oh, just sad. I mean, 
The turnout has been amazing, actually. I, I gotta say, best turnout ever, but... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Sadness. Sadness. Sadness aside, let's clean my inventory out a bit. No! 